Hi guys welcome. Today, we're gonna talk about the ignition or main switch of a motorcycle. The most common ignition switch variants are, 2 wires and 4 wires. The 4 wires ignition switches are commonly found on AC type CDI motorcycles, because this type of CDI have a kill switch wire, which is colored black with white stripes on a Honda and Chinese made motorcycles. When this wire is connected to the ground, green. The CDI will no longer send signals to the ignition coil, thus the motorcycle's engine stop. The kill switch wire sometimes has separate button on the right handle bar, which is connected to the kill switch wire of the ignition. When the main switch is in the off position, the kill switch wire have contact to the ground wire, hence the motorcycle won't start. Contrary, when the ignition switch turned to the on position, the kill switch wire will no longer have contact to the ground wire, and pushing the starter button will start the engine. The two remaining wires are colored red, and black. The red wire is connected to a 10 amps fuse before going to the main switch and regulator's red wire. In addition, the red wire is connected to the battery's positive terminal, if the main switch is in the on position, the current from the red wire flows to the accessory wire, black wire. The black wire is called accessory wire because this wire is the main source of the accessories like the horn, lighting systems, and starter system. Some motorcycles with four wires ignition switch will have a AC type headlight and other will have a DC type headlight that is connected to the accessory wire. Testing of four wires ignition switch using a multimeter. Set the multimeter to connectivity mode, point the arrow with the sound or beep sign. Test the lid, when a beep is generated, that means the connection is good. Connect one lid to the green wire and the other to the black with white stripes wire. These two wire will always have a connection when the ignition switch is in the off position. Turn the key to the on position. The green wire and black with white stripes wire will have no connection. This time, while the ignition switch is in the on position, Connect one lid to the red wire and the other to the black wire. The two wires will have connection. On the other hand, the black and red wire will have no connection if the ignition switch is in the off position. Replace the ignition switch if these requirements are not met. Two wires ignition switch. This type of ignition switch is very simple, the two wires are the accessory wire and red wire. The accessory wire for Honda and China made motorcycles is color black, brown for Yamaha and Kawasaki motorcycles, orange for Suzuki motorcycles. The red wire is connected to the battery's positive terminal and connects the ignition switch and regulator's red wire with a 10 amperes fuse. When the ignition switch is turned in the on position, the red wire currents transfer to the accessory wire. The horn, lighting systems, and starting system are connected to the accessory wire. The accessory wire supply them all with a positive connection. Two wires ignition switch is common on a motorcycle with DC type CDI because this type of CDI is connected to the accessory wire and the accessory wire supplies it with a DC positive voltage. Hence when the ignition switch is in the off position the CDI won't work and the motorcycle won't start. Testing two wires ignition switch with a battery and lead without multimeter. 
connect the positive terminal of the LED to the positive terminal of the battery. Connect one wire of the ignition switch to the negative terminal of the LED. Connect the other wire of the ignition switch to the negative terminal of the battery. Turn the key to on position, if the LED lights up, the ignition switch is good. On the other hand, if the LED does not light up, check the connections. If nothing happens, replace the ignition switch. The ignition switch is also equipped with a bolt that locks the steering post. 